Hello and welcome to Try It Tuesday. I don't know if it's already like some video out there named Try It Tuesday, but I'm gonna start a new series called Try It Tuesday, where every Tuesday I'm gonna post a video of me trying something new. Um, I'm wearing these glasses because they're cute. I got these from um, a Bella eyewear off of Instagram and I am an ambassador with them, which basically just means I have an affiliate code where I give you a discount code and then I get a percentage of it if anyone buys from it, just being honest. Um, these honestly are my favorite glasses right now. Um, I like them because they feel like 70s or like, you know, like different. Um, but yeah, I do have a code for their um, glasses. They're 20%, oh no, 30% off code. Um, for the glasses and I'll be honest with you. They're not like the most sturdy thing in the world. They're kind of flimsy, but They're cute though. So anyways, let's get right into what I'm doing today I'm gonna be testing out this tattoo studio by Maybelline and the color that I got is 260 deep brown and basically what it says is you can wear this up to two days um yeah, it's like a tattoo for your eyebrows. So it's summer and who even likes doing their eyebrows anyway? So let's just try it out. Okay, so in the box it comes with this, the studio gel. And then it does come with a little mini spoolie, which is really nice, which I guess we're gonna be using. From reading the directions, it just says to go in with, let's read it actually. Get brows for days. New waterproof brow gel lasts up to two days. Uh, does not transfer and smudge and it's waterproof. Um, it says, pro tip, remove excess from formula from tip. Short, smooth stroke starting mid-brow, then fill blend toward, fill and blend towards the end of start of brow. Start of brow? Okay, well, let's just fill it in like we're doing our brows. So my face is clean. I can't say the same for my hair. Let's just look at this really quick. Ugh. Super blurry, I'm sorry. That doesn't help either. All right, so it said to brush uh, the excess off the tip, so I'm gonna just go like that lightly on this rag that I have. And let's just start filling it in, I guess. Let's brush it out with a spoolie. Ew, looks like a caterpillar right now. Oh my gosh, it's getting up on my, my skin right there. Let's use this to wipe it off, there we go. I don't like that part right there, but that's like where I normally have to fill in my brows. Let's try to wipe it down a little bit. Yeah, you can like clearly see that's just skin right there. There's no hair. Let's do the other one. Okay, I went ahead and did this eyebrow and let's be honest, I look pretty fugs right now. Um, yeah, so this is supposed to like stay on your eyebrows. You're not supposed to like, it's not like a dye where you would like put it on and then clean it off like it's supposed to just stay it's already feeling like dry when I rub my finger across it it just feels sticky but it doesn't transfer onto your finger but it feels sticky so I'm gonna clean up my eyebrows just with my concealer that I always use to clean up my brows which is really light but we're gonna see if we can make these look a little better because they look like caterpillar eyebrows right now I mean so it looks a little bit better I think right now my eyebrows are just thick 
anyways, so I'm not really feeling the thick eyebrows. But this uh, concealer, it does go over it pretty well. Like, it doesn't... Uh, it covers the parts you want it to cover, so... If you're gonna conceal, like, clean up the lines, I would suggest using, like, a really thick... Um, a really thick concealer. The only part I'm having trouble with like making nice is the ends so you can see right here and that's just me like sucking they feel crispy <laughs> my eyeballs is crispy okay it passed the finger test it didn't transfer onto my finger let's see if it can pass the water test so I have water in this it says detangler but that's been used up and I put water in it because why buy a new bottle when you can just use one you have so, I bet this is going to take off my concealer. Okay, I put a pretty generous amount. <laughs> hey guys. Put a pretty generous amount. I'm just going to wipe my eyes off with my face. But, my eyebrows are pretty wet. Nada. Let me try a little bit more water. I'm gonna spray right onto my eyebrow. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty. So, nothing. It's really not coming off, guys. Even like trying to push it hard. You can see my concealer coming off, but this is not. It's not padded. Oh, pff, see, look, my concealer. My concealer is not trying to, I'm gonna wipe it like that. Well, you can't see this is a dark towel, but nothing. And this is supposed to stay on for two days, it said. So I'm going to, um, just because, I mean, this is just one day, obviously, and I just barely put it on. But I will check in with you tomorrow, and then I'll probably check in with you the next day. So we'll do the full two days on this and see how it wears and holds up for the two days. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's not bad. It it looks like how I would my brows would normally look if I filled them in with product. And I kind of like the fact that they're like kind of hard. They feel like they're just staying in place. So we'll see how they hold up. Ooh. Okay, guys, we're on day two. And I'm gonna be honest with you, I took a shower last night and I had to wash my face. I totally forgot that I was even wearing this. Uh, I mean, wearing the eyebrow stuff. And a lot of it came off on the ends, but a lot of it stayed on uh, towards this part of my eyebrow. And I did have to refill it in. Um, so I would say that this eyebrow's all messed up. But I would say that this is a good product if you're gonna be like swimming for the day or you're like on vacation and you're just like doing brows and you just don't want your um, brows to come off I think this is a good product for that but as far as like trying to wear it for like a whole week or like even two days like it's just not gonna happen with you showering and washing your face it's not gonna stay on there it stays on with water but as soon as you put any type of like makeup remover or soap it will come off so um, yeah, I mean, it, it's, a, it's a good product and I'll continue to use it, but like I said, it's probably more for like a day at the pool or something like that. So that is my review on the eyebrow products and yeah. Okay, now that I've given you my final thoughts, which I really don't know what they are right now because I'm filming this the same day I put it on, but now that I've given you my final thoughts, I want to just thank you for watching this video and please like and subscribe, you know, the whole spill. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.